All right, here we are. Wild card round of the playoffs. What's up? Any suggestions on how to speed the computer up? How to speed the computer up? What are you talking about? On my laptop. Uh, yeah, there's a few things you could run. Things like uh, C Cleaner, which is really just crap cleaner, and Adaware, and any of the virus protection stuff. Anything like that that'll help clean up the computer, that's what you want to run. So. But yeah, here we go. Wild card playoffs. Yeah. Well, no, not necessarily Norton Virus Protector, but yeah, C Cleaner and Adaware are two that I would recommend. So. All right, wild card round of the playoffs. Falcons, Lions. And if you remember, Lions beat us in the regular season, 31 to 20. So this is a revenge game. No need to go through all this stuff here. We're going to go ahead and jump right into the game. So let's play this wild card game. But yes, I couldn't put it down. I could not put this down. I really want to get this game here and hopefully end up getting our first offseason win. I need it, Express, man. I got to have this win here. <laughs> I'm tired of being one and done. I did happen to look at the injuries, and with their starting quarterback being out, we got a good shot. That's, there's more than just that, but that was one of the big ones. I really didn't throw to Julio that much this year, though. I did realize that. I think Julio all in all had like 30-something catches for the whole season. How many minutes you playing on? Uh, Whatever the default is. I think it's six-minute quarters. So, Jermaine Gresham, though, was at 40 catches. Yeah. Hello, everybody. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. Let's do this. It's officially winning time in the NFL. In today's wild card matchup, Victor is the only option. Yeah, Julio has 30 catches, 730 yards, and five touchdowns. Calvin Johnson, 86 so catches, 1,276 yards, and 10 touchdowns. <laughs> that is crazy. Matt Bosher, ready to kick it away to start the game. The Lions are back deep, waiting for the kick return. They got Darius Slay back returning it. And with that kick, this wild card matchup is underway. He'll have a chance to take off. Able to move past the 20. There we go. And brought down <coughs> I really need my guys to have a big game in this one, man. I tell you. <laughs> Landry Jones, 320 passing yards, four touchdowns, no interceptions. Oh, man. Gotta love the backups. I wonder if we can get after him, too. I don't know if Landry Jones can run or not. Like 70 speed? Okay. Ooh, we. They almost caught that, though. And with this starting unit, as usual, the attention goes to the wide receivers who so often open up the game. Let's go. Three, three. Second and ten. Complete to Calvin Johnson. Calvin Johnson caught one over the middle. Seven, seven yards. That wasn't no seven yards. Down, they don't force the football down the field. They throw it short. They pick up some solid yards to make it a good situation for them. Third short. The Lions will take the snap from the 30. Oh, they're going to call roughing the passer on me, I bet. I bet that's what they're going to call. Nope, holding on the offense. I'll take that all day. The defense accepts the penalty. Third down after the penalty. The Falcons will come out in the dive. Looks like Oh, come defense. on. <laughs> One of my D tackles jumped offside. I think that was Nick Fairley. Oh my gosh. 
Oh no, that was Kawan Short. Still third down. Still third though. Down after the penalty. The Lions have to get to the 33 for a first. Jones got it in the gun. Throws the pass. A nice grab. What no the way. heck? Hold on to that one. The Lions on their offensive play sheet. They don't have Landry Jones is actually tearing us apart right now in the passing and game. That's a really nice job that time by the offense, the quarterback. I didn't think he was that good. That'll get you going. Here's the first snap. Is he actually that good, Express? Takes it from the gun. <laughs> Secures it with two hands. But right now, he's finding people all over the field. Well, I guess the best thing to say there, Jim, is they completed the pass, but it still did not get a first down. That short pass play picked up six. It's now second down and four. There should be a free version of that, man. Falcons with a nickel look here on defense. The Lions now move the chains. Well, if you guard the tight end close, it, it, sometimes that doesn't matter. They're so big and they got long right. arms, they can still make the catch. All right, fellas, we need an answer hands, here. They get it done. We need to stop them somehow. They'll go shotgun here. There we go. Hold on to it after the hit. Managed to force that one. Here's the defense, a unit that works best when it gets to the quarterback. That leads us to second down. Jones is going to take the snap from the shotgun. Calvin Johnson with the grab. What in the world are we doing? Well, as you saw that receiver make the catch, I'll just say this. You cannot throw the football enough his way. Uh, there's no such thing. When in doubt, you don't like anything, turn and find him and throw it to him. First down and ten. And it's incomplete. Just can't hold wow. it that time. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. The Lions have it at the 29. There we go. Got a sack, finally. That's a bad job by the offense that time. There's no doubt about it. The blitz by the defense, they do not do a good job of finding out where everybody's blitzing from. They let a guy come free, and that free blitzer, or as we call them, free runners, he gets the hit on the QB and takes him down. Looking at every option. And they'll get to him again for the sack. I kid you not, their quarterback sat back there for like six seconds, seven seconds. And we still managed to get the sack on him. Well, that time the quarterback is sacked on the third down, and that's of course that's bad. But like six or seven is, seconds in the back, the in the uh, in the pocket. The we did eventually, but it took us like six or seven seconds to get to him. So we're forcing him to punt. We knocked him out of field goal range. It's fourth and twenty-seven right now from there from our forty-six. And they punted it out at the four-yard line. Oh, my gosh. Let's see. Hudson. 2,702 yards, 17 touchdowns, 25 interceptions. I think things have changed so much over the years. These quarterbacks, especially these rookies, they're so much more ready to play than previous years. They get to throw the football a lot in college, a lot in high school. So they come in the NFL prepared and ready to go. Let's go. That's what we needed. That's exactly what we needed right there to get us out of that. If you're running back and you want more carries, do things like this. Read the defense right, read the blocking, and pick up first downs. That's a really good job by the running back. First and ten. Looking to go down. Oh my gosh, he threw it out of bounds. Julio beat his man one on one, and our quarterback throws this it out of bounds. Line today will be leaned on to protect their quarterback as well as opening up some running lanes. Can't believe After that crap. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. 
tosses the football. Coleman's brought down at the 20. Come on. As we get a look at the defensive starters, this secondary will certainly need to be on point here in the passing game. The Lions lined up in the nickel. Third and eight. Looking low. Oh, come on, Julio. Come on, Julio. Can't believe this crap. He has a chance of going all the way. Julio one on one and he gets knocked out of his hands. Bush has got it now. He is brought down Come on, at the 49 yard line. That returns good. But he had it though. That's my point, is he had it in his hands. That shouldn't have been knocked out. On the previous two possessions. Yeah, when you when you're playing a game like this as a quarterback, you know the defenses are hot, and the one you're playing against is tough. So you got to be careful, be very smart in your decision making. Don't take any chances. Oh my gosh, Calvin Johnson just burned Truth on. Wow. What a job by the offense going down there and getting the first touchdown in this wild card game today. That'll ease the tension, give you a little confidence. All right, we get still got to respect jitters. Calvin Johnson. <laughs> Can't do that again. The Falcons in kick return formation. I like it. It allows me to see a lot more. Touchback now as the ball comes out to the 20. <laughs> I can't stand the other ones. They're too close. I'm like, I can't see what's going on with the other one. Welcome back to this defensive showdown. My goodness. Can we get some? And they're just playing press coverage on our receivers. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Grabs it with one oh, eight. nice grab. What is it? What's the penalty? Holding defense. Yes. Decline that junk. They'll decline the penalty and let the play stand. First down, offense readying for the snap. This play set up by the long gainer. They'll run it off the toss. Robinson's in on the tackle. Let's go. What a good job by the running back that time. He reads the box very well, and he picks his way through there and picks up a first down. That's, that's nice. First down at the 36. Down on the field. This will be ruled incomplete. To oh, get the feet come down. on. Good try. Throw it deep down the field. You got to come up with a way to get those. Goes incomplete. Set up come on, now, fellas. 36. Second down and 10. Has his man. That's a gain of I'll take it. That was a nice job by the offense. It just puts them in a better position. Nice little throw and catch. Third and four coming up following that completion. Double tight end formation. Quarterback likes what he sees out there outside. He's changing the play. That wasn't where that was supposed to go. Well, these are the kind of throws in the NFL, Jim. You just take for what the heck is he doing? If it's open, you are going to hit it. But the quarterback makes a big mistake, leads the receiver too far to the inside, and it goes incomplete. Oh my gosh. For the offense. Another chance to the wayside as the kick is no good. The Thought I had it over enough. The game, and that's one that they missed and then uh, they just got to hope it doesn't come back to haunt them. The Lions offense coming back onto the field. It was a good drive for them the last time they had it. All the way yeah. The end zone but I thought I had it over yeah, enough. This game, Jim, it's all about momentum. And when you feel you got the momentum on your side, you got to take advantage of it. So now I think it's up to the offensive coordinator to call the right play. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense. I know. I know. 
Now the defense is in a good Maybe we're just play. nervous. Maybe that's what it is. Well, how much does all this media attention in the postseason affect these players? Uh, the, Jim, the players know how to handle it. They don't get too excited. In other words, they're not going to let the fact that there's reporters they've never seen before in the locker room during the season that, that are now there, they don't care. They just go out and play. Third down and two. He's going to get another carry. And now what the heck was that? After this play. How did that happen? Cortez able to get it done that time. Why? Because he has the power and the will to make I can't it even. I, I want to blitz, but I'm so scared of Calvin Johnson now, though, man. Willpower. The Falcons' defense now is going to go nickel. Now first and ten. Reggie with the reception. Andrew Jones, seven for ten. Come on, fellas. The Lions are up right now, Phil. And that's at least partly due to the play of the quarterback. Jones has had a very solid opening half. He sure has. And then people are getting open down the field, Jim, and he's right on target. He's feeling it. He is absolutely in the groove. Two minute warning. Two minute warning. Wow. All right, and welcome back where we've got an offense on that field that wants to try and increase the lead before we move to halftime. The Lions snap it at the 41. Makes the catch. It's Come the on. Field. Mark him down. Really? For another reception. When the football's in the air, the receiver on the curl route has to see it and come back towards the quarterback. That's what he did that time. That's why they got the completion. Jones back in shotgun formation. No room to complete that. How? How did he have all day nice back there? Time by the receiver running the corner route, and the quarterback just throws it too far and misses it. Jones lined up no extra blockers for this snap. Dropping back now into the shotgun. Rodgers got the catch. I swear we're first. draped all over them, man, and they still coming up with these catches. I don't know if you're seeing it or not. They get the first down, Jim. That's what you want to do. Oh my gosh! Now you give your offense three more opportunities. Jones is setting up now in the pistol. First and ten. Reaches out and snatches it. The Lions signal for the timeout, and that's the first one they've used. Second down coming up with about a minute to go before intermission. The Falcons with two extra defensive backs in the dime. Jones is standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Harper's able to move. What the, the heck, fellas? He's tackled down. This long drive continues. Goal line defense on the field. First and goal from the three. To Ebron. Defense calls a timeout. Second and goal. Here's the handle. And Branch is the one who made the big stop. Falcons call a timeout and are left now with only one. The ball just the nose outside of the goal line. Third and goal from the one. Oh, he come on. Line. He's in for the touchdown. Wow. Come on, fellas. 
start to this game. Here we are late in the second quarter. They put up another touchdown, Phil. Well, they got a nice lead, and they like to take this in at halftime. And if you're the coach of the team that's leading at halftime, you know what you tell your players? Hey, guys, good job. Let's keep that going. You pat them on the rear and tell them how good they are because, hey, this has been a clinic so far in the first half. And he'll start his return. And the tackle is made right around the 26-yard line. Oh, no, not 16. 14. <laughs> we'll send it back to the quarterback out of the gun. Oh, my gosh. They bring him to the turf. I hate that animation. I swear I do. I really do. The intermission is right around the corner, and they continue to smother the opposition. Hey, they want to go in at halftime, Jim, with a big zero on the board for the other team. They deserve it. This is a tough defense that plays hard, and they have been whipping some tail out here in the first half. Let's go. That's what we needed. We're headed to the half. And could this be the spark this offense needs to get points on the board? Well, I'd hope so. You know, what you got to say, the offense is not... It, the teaching moment here is this. Just wake up and show some energy. That's the first thing you need to do on the offensive side. And it's complete to Gresham. The Falcons have to take their final timeout. That's it. The football rests at the 44. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. And, but the hit knocks the ball out. Oh Good my timing gosh. by the defensive player that time. He gets to the receiver just as the football is getting there and makes the hit, knocks that football loose. Quarterback's picked up on something. He's changing the play here. Ooh. How the heck did they come through untouched? The pass goes incomplete. Third down. The I don't know what happened. To get to the 34 for a first down. Out of the shotgun formation. And he's able to find Julio Jones. And we couldn't get up there to the line. Oh my gosh. Larry Ridley back in our studios as we continue with the NFL on EA Sports. With this kick, the second half is underway. He's got a chance to return this one. And the tackle's made right around the 25 yard line. The Lions have played some amazing opportunistic defense so far in this game. They've been physically dominant, looking virtually impenetrable, and still pitching a shutout. You said it. They have been awesome on the defensive side, dominating physically, just doing everything they want, and hustling to the football. When you do all these things, that's why you've given up no points. After the pass play, gain seven. Second and three on the way. Yeah. Outside now on the toss. There we go. Well, when your team is behind, what do you do? Just come out there and get a first down. That's a nice job by the offense. First down at the 44. Toss to the outside. Now they take the football on the <coughs> opponent side of the field. You're running back in this league and you pick up first downs and you don't bump the football, I promise you one thing, you're going to get more carries. First down at the in the board. first half, yeah. Oh, come on. And now he'll take off. No! What the heck was that? Oh! Oh my gosh, there's got to be a way to One let me just straight did. act as a runner, man. On the field is oh my gosh. The football. Because a lot of times, it's just bad fundamentals. But they're lucky this time, they have the fumble, they're able to get on top of it. Gresham's got it on a pass, had some heat on it. 
Come on, fellas. This drive is taking too long. Nice job that time by the tight end makes the catch and it is really taking too long. Remember, they're usually the closest receiver to Yeah, he did, but the thing is, I was trying to juke and he did the pump fake. I know, which sucks. I wish there was still that dedicated button where I could hold it down and he'll act like a runner. They come to the line of scrimmage. I really wish they had still had that in the game. First down and ten. Get this. Yes! Let's go. Let's go, Brandon. Oh, man. Taking a chunk out of the lead with that touchdown midway through the third quarter and suddenly right back in it. Yeah, they needed that touchdown. There's no question about it. Now the defensive coaches, you need to go out there and give your players something new. Try to catch the offense off guard so you huh? can take the lead in this football game. It's uh, one of my young wide receivers. He's in his second year in the league, a dude named Dellens Brandon. 6'4 wide receiver. <laughs> I'm just happy he came down with that jump, man. I am so happy. The way this game has been going, had that been Julio, that might have been popped up into the air. The last time they had the ball, the turnover they committed immediately turned into points against them. Yeah, it did, Jim, but you know what? It's not a perfect game. You got to deal with adversity when you're talking about football. So you made that mistake. Let it go and go out there, be aggressive. And see if you can score some oh my goals. gosh! Come on, fellas! I don't know what the is. Why can't we cover this? These tight ends now. There's just not much you can do. Uh, I'll tell you the best way to stop the tight end: rush the quarterback. Now y'all play off it, them, please. The Lions snap it at the 26. Thank you. Thank you. It's a coordinator. My gosh, he is one happy guy. Anytime you get in the backfield and stop the runner and make him lose yards, that's a good step. Jones got no one behind him. Just a quarterback waiting for the snap. Third and five. There we go. That's what I wanted to see right there. excited anytime on third down they make the play uh, they get pretty fired up but when you sack a quarterback on third down that is one happy and emotional defense right now he's got a chance for a return the tackle is made at the 40 yard line. there we go that kick return that was a nice return what a good Trey job Robinson return at that time he caught it didn't panic. He waited. He saw the blocking in front of him. Made some good decisions and a good punt return. As the defense readies for the next possession, they have to be very satisfied with the way this game has played out. They really minimized the damage done against them up to this point. It's turned off. I think that might be turned all the way down. I don't even know. <clears throat> I'm not even certain. Yeah, he is. And our man, the star, they are dominating the offense right now. Second and three after that last carry. Oh, oh, Jermaine Gresham. Oh, my gosh, you have that catch. That might be a touchdown. Oh, my gosh. It's so hard to be a defensive back in the NFL to cover some of the fastest runners in the world to do that. And also, we know they can't touch them either. So they're having an outstanding day. Wow, he dropped that. Man, what the heck was that? Man, I'm going for this. Bump this. We need this the first down. Is still on the field right now. Fourth down, and they'll need to pick up two. Let's go. The Falcons from the 32. We didn't get it. We can't hold a freaking block. Oh, my gosh. I thought it was a little too early to take that gamble. You're down by a few points in the second half, and you go for it on fourth down. That's a big decision, and I think it was the wrong decision. This should be the last play of the quarter. The Lions take it from the 33. Forte looking for space. 
You see that crap? We couldn't hold our block right there, man. The heck? play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. The Falcons defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. The final quarter begins with this snap. Man, if we don't get there. Down at the 40. He's averaging about three yards a carry on the day. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. The Lions will take the snap from the 40. Scanning the field. Yes, he dropped it. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, snap. Come on. They're in punting formation. I know. We can't get to this quarterback. I've been doing that, and I struggle to get off, too. certain to come away with points the last time they had the ball. But instead of attempting a field goal, they went for it. Oh, like, they're blocking, man. They've, like, upped it in the playoffs, bro. This it's, it's ridiculous, yeah, look, man. This isn't high school or college football where you get many, many possessions. And the pros, you don't get that many. Yeah. You get a chance to get points. You got to take they all do. and take those points. The Lions have figured out a way to find It's like y'all going to let me call my play game. here? Come it's on, now. a big point of contention for them all season long. Thankfully for them today, they figured it out. Yeah, they have. You know, listen. These get there. Get there. There we go. There we go. But today they've settled in. That's the kind of blocking I needed to see, man. Where'd that been at all game? Falcons have stayed with the run game today, and it's been a big part of their game plan. Coleman's been absolutely brilliant and almost impossible to bring down. What a dominating Look at this. What was that? Hitting the defense, giving the running back opportunities, and they are taking advantage of it. And they called holding on us. Oh my gosh. That penalty is, of course, going to be accepted by the defense. And they accepted it. First and 20. Down the field. Julio, if you don't come down with this, thank you. Oh my gosh. Safety stepped up. That better be a catch. Picking up that first down, and Jim, of course, there's no time to panic in a situation like this. I think they know that. It's in the second half. You got your you're down just a few points. Just keep looking for ways to get another first down, and that'll serve your team well. Running room for a gain of about five. Always be alert for this quarterback to run the football when he gets the chance. He is excellent with it. He has a quarterback with the abilities of a running back. Second down and five. Takes it from the strong eye. The, no. Y'all didn't know. Come on. Not another one. Oh, my gosh. How? How did he hold? To the penalty it's That's some second bull. down and 15 from the shotgun going deep pass is intercepted i hate that animation i hate that animation i really do jones has tried to adjust to the defense huh? but it hasn't worked out well he's trying uh, to listen there's nothing he can do about the uh, it just depends on how i feel like playing it sharp, i'll tell you what when an offensive line is not sharp a quarterback's gonna lose confidence hand off Forte's tackled down after a game like i didn't do much in the in the week he's averaging about three yards to carry on the day second down here after that run play Good job that time by the defense. They're down. It's in the fourth quarter. They are expecting the offense to run the football, and they stop it for a couple yards. Long ball to Calvin Johnson. Yes. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you, Janoris Jenkins. Oh, my gosh. 
It's because about to have a dog on heart track out here, man. Just not serious about what you're doing. The clock's really become a factor here, and the defense knows it has to get off the field as soon as possible to give the team a chance. Oh my gosh. What are we doing? What are we doing, Phil? He's fast enough, apparently. I'm not pressing them. That's the thing. I am not pressing them. If they are pressing, they are doing that on their own. And we can't make a tackle? Come on now. Oh my gosh. Second down coming up. We're late in the game, and the offense is in no hurry. They'll run it with him again. Forte up the middle. Oh my gosh. Two minutes to go before this one's Dude, watch this next play, you'll see. You see how many tackles Forte breaks? No, that's the thing. I was trying everything. I tried A, tried X, tried whatever. Man. Nope. What the heck are we doing out here? second to be preserved at this point the offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive second down and seven Bush and that's good for only a yard or two the Falcons stop the clock in a hurry trying to hold on to every precious second this will be the eighth play of this drive. The Lions will take the snap from the 45. Forte up the middle. That'll do it. Going to be We're going to be one and done again. The 35 -yard line. I don't know what else to do, man. I load the box up. And they still keep running it right there. I'm so frustrated right now. You have no idea. And they did this with their backup quarterback. What a drive this has been. Unfreaking believable. And that's going to do it in this wild card matchup. One team moving on to the divisional round, and the other heads home for the long off season. A lot of folks thought this was a championship caliber team, but their season ends. We today. we dominated in every aspect of the game, and we couldn't finish. So hard to get to the playoffs and to lose the way that you did. Oh my gosh! You didn't lose it. You just gave it away. You just gave it to the other team, and they took it. Now you got to go home and think about it. How in the world did that happen?